back. I'm back, y'all. I'm back with another video. Happy Monday to you all. Today is Monday, and I am feeling fine. Today I had to go to the doctor. Nothing serious, but, you know, and I looked around the doctor's office and seen so many people, so many sick people today. We gonna talk about today sickness. That's what we gonna talk about. Sickness. Okay, y'all. We gonna be talking about sickness. Let's do a quick prayer and let's get right down to it. Father God, in the name of Jesus, we come back to you for another beautiful and wonderful day that you have made. And we're going to rejoice and we're going to be glad in it. We come thanking you for letting us down last night, waking us up this morning, still in our right mind, clothed in our right mind, Jesus. Didn't have to do it, but you did. Then we come asking you to forgive us for sin, seen and unseen sin, dear Lord. Dear Lord, if we have wronged anyone and don't know it, dear Lord, we ask for forgiveness. Then we ask, dear Lord, as you look down on us, our sickness in our body, dear Lord. Some of us, our body racking with pain. Some of us is just sick and we don't look like we can get well. We just need you, dear Lord. We need a healing a touch from you that only you can do. The doctors can only just give us what we say is sick in our body, but we do know that you is the healing, and you have a healing power. You work through the medicine to heal us. So we asking you for healing all over the world, dear Lord. Dear Lord, our bones is aching, we stiffening, we stealing, and you know, COVID-19 is rampaging and all other kind of sickness and diseases. Dear Lord, we ask, dear Lord, that you cover us and you guide us under your grace and your mercy. Cover us under your blood. You said by your stripe that we are healed, and we are claiming healing today, dear Lord. Dear Lord, we ask this. As we discuss your word today, let it give us a word from you on how, how to change and how to do your will and how to be better representative for you. I ask this in Jesus' name, I pray. Amen and glory be to your holy name. Sickness is what we're going to be talking about. Um, I went to the doctor today. And, and you know, y'all y'all see I'm sniffing a little bit, you know, a little sinus is an allergy. But I went for the, get my pressure pills refilled. You know, nothing serious. But, you know, and I looked around over the doctor's office, all the sick people that come in. And there were some was there when I got there. Some on came and some pulled it in the wheelchair and some just, you can just tell when a person is sick and don't feel well, you know, we done been there, done that. I'm, you know, I'm going through a little sniffling because we that cold one minute and hot the next minute and air blowing one minute and the heat next minute, you know, this kind of weather, you know, people that suffer with allergies and sinuses and stuff like this, this kind of weather here kind of have you a little down. And there's just so much sickness going on in the world. I just looked around at him and said, Lord, I know you can heal. You did it over and over and over again for me. And not only me, in the olden days, you know, you had people that were sick and you were raising them for me. You still the same God today, yesterday, and forevermore. You can heal us. Have mercy on us, Lord. We need you. Because there's just so much sickness going on. If anything, the devil that want to attack is, is our help. But I know you got all power over the devil that you can do anything but fail. Heal the land. Heal the land. I ain't going to be on here too long. I'm just going to read a couple of things about sickness. Sickness. 
We live in a world that is married by sin, which means that our bodies, our body evidently wear out and we will face death. The body and drink are going to wear out and we will face death. You can tell, you know, as you get older, your shoulder hurting, your back hurting, your knees are giving out on you, your bones is popping. And, you know, we get getting old. You know, we're going to leave here one day. Death will come to us all. But prior to death, we experience weakness in our physical body. The decay, the decay that is continuous working in us, whether cancer or a cold, diabetes or a bone broke, we all face some sorts of sickness in our physical body. We're going to have to just take care of ourselves. We got to learn how to eat right. We got to exercise. We just got to do better than what we're doing. I know me. I love salt, you all. And that's my weakness. I just like my taste of season in my food. So if I would slack back on the salt, which I am, slack back on the salt, exercise and eat right, I would need the pressure pill. But and I know I love the salt. And I ain't doing no exercise. And I can be so tired and I get all work. Got to do better. That, uh, so, a sickness is coming. You know, got to take care of ourselves. It said, the Bible say that when we are sick, we, we can come boldly to the throne of God, asking for grace and mercy in our time of need. Oh, thank you, Lord. Grace and mercy through our bodies. Though our bodies don't feel well, God still rules over our circumstance. And Jesus still has the healing power and the authorities to heal us. Not to mention he's willing and able to do so. He's willing to heal us. He's able to do so. All he, we got to do is call on him. Call on him. I'm calling you Jesus. Jesus, I need you. Can't get along without you. Heal the land. Okay, y'all, y'all make me make up a song. Okay, uh, it said we can approach Jesus with faith and expectation, believing that he is still healing the sick, setting us free, and ex exercising dimension over our physical body. We will all eventually die. But that doesn't mean that Jesus isn't interesting in healing our body today. We considerably call out to him and bring bringing healing into our lives. That's all you want us to do is call on, pray y'all ye for one another that the Lord will heal our body, not only our, anybody else that needs a healing. All right. The promise. That's what we had. It said, let us therefore come boldly to the throne of grace that we may obtain mercy and find grace to help in a time of need. That's Hebrew 4 and 26. That's in the, the New King James. It says, bless the Lord, O my soul, and all that within me. Bless his holy name. Bless the Lord, O my soul, and forget not all his benefits, who forgives all our iniquity. Yours, ours, who heal all our diseases. 
That's in Psalm 103, 1 through 3. And that's in the, the English Standard Version. It says, when, when she heard about Jesus, she came up upon him in the crowd and touched his cloak. This is a lady with the issue of blood. Because she thought, if I just touch his clothes, I will be healed. And that's Mark 5 and 27 verse. And this going to be 27 through 28. And this going to be in a new international version. That's a woman with the issue of blood where she bled all them years. And went to all the doctors, and the doctors said to doctor, doctors, doctor could not do anything. I mean, couldn't do anything. So, she she heard Jesus was coming through. Hmm. She, she said, "All I got to do is get to him, touch to him on his garment, and I will be made whole." We are gonna say a quick prayer after this hymn of healing. Father God, in the name of Jesus, I come asking for healing, dear Lord. Dear Lord, you know all about this body. This is your temple. You know how I hurt sometimes. You know how I'm stiffening now, dear Lord. Dear Lord, I ask you to heal me. Touch me right now. Renewing my body a clean, clean bill of health. Lord, strengthen me where I'm torn down. Lift me up where I'm weakened, Lord. I ask this, dear Lord, and not only me. Lord, I ask you to touch everybody that's dealing with pain of any sort or any sickness or any disease, dear Lord. You said that you would put more on us than we can bear. I believe it, we believe it, because you said it. So we are asking, dear Lord, for healing. Heal the land, dear Lord. You told us that if my people are called by your name, that we will repent and we will turn from our wicked ways. You will heal the land. We are asking for healing, dear Lord. Dear Lord, we need you. Touch us, Lord. Everybody that are sick. I have some YouTube subscribers, dear Lord. They're sick. I haven't heard from some in a while. I look on them. But if whatever they have need of may not be sickness, may be family member, maybe they're on vacation. But dear Lord, I ask you to look down on them. Heal them where they are torn down. Build them up where they are. They're weak, dear Lord. And if they're sick, dear Lord, I ask for a healing. On my job, there's so many sick people, dear Lord. I ask you to look down on the employees at 182 Walmart. So many of us need you, dear Lord. We just can't get along without you. And not just on my job. This just bless and heal all over the world. You walk when you was here on earth healing people from land to land and country to country and city to city. You're the same God now that you were back then. And we ask you to walk around this earth and heal the land. So much sickness going on, dear Lord. I ask this of your son. Jesus, dear Lord, I pray, amen, and glory be to your holy name. Oh, thank you, Lord. Thank you, Jesus. I pray everybody's well, and I pray everybody that we do well and take care of ourselves. So, with that being said, if you like the video, go ahead on, hit the like button. Subscribe to the channel. If you want to leave me 
a cummy. Go ahead home and leave a comment. Leave me, let me know y'all how you doing. I miss a lot of you all because you know I work and then I went to went on went to Memphis this weekend and I just need to know that you're okay. If I don't see a video within that week, I know something going wrong. Hit me and say I'm doing okay. Because I just be praying for the ones that I don't see. So, now, we are down to, I already said you want to leave me a comment. If you want to be notified when I put anything else on, go ahead on and hit the notification bell. So you can be notified when everything, anytime it's your poop, anything on. I love you all. Jesus loves you so, so much. And so do I. Take care of yourself. Be good to one another. Love one another like Jesus loves us. And I will see you on the next video. Hey, no problem.